Hi, this is Cooking with the Easleys, and thank you for tuning in to the Easley family. Today, we're going to be making the juicy crab garlic butter sauce along with the crab boil. We're totally addicted to this stuff, and since we're on quarantine, we can't find it anywhere else, so we decided to make it ourselves. You and me will always be tied. You know I love you every single day and night. Even when we start a trip and lose our cool. You know I'm loving every single thing you do. Courtney, love, you my only one. Money, money, gonna always keep it fun. Baby, girl, you know it's clear to see. That you know that I know I love our family. Family, family. The Easley family will make you say that family should stay. The family, family, Easley family, Easley family will take your love. Cause we just some love thugs. The family, family, Easley family. Yo! <laughs> and that's a remix. What's up, YouTube? This your boy, Money Mind. And this your girl, Courtney. And we back with another video. And we back with another video. We <laughs> and we back with, with another banger. All right, guys, I'm going to give you a rundown of the ingredients we're using. Red potatoes, corn, fresh garlic, Tuscan herb butter, Georgia boy sausage, um, sliced onions, butter, lemon, xanarans, concentrated mix, chicken broth, the host of seasonings that you see I will go over, and, of course, our one pound of shrimp and two pounds of crab legs. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the potatoes on, get them boiling because that takes the longest out of everything. I've already went through, washed my potatoes, and I peeled off the ugly pieces because if y'all anything like me, I'm a picky eater, and I don't like. I don't like that. Like even the black veins in the chicken, I have to peel out because it's so nasty. Like, who eats that? Right here, I'm just putting in the potatoes, but I want you guys to enjoy some cooking ASMR. I'm gonna drop my eggs in the water to boil. Right now we got the cooking with the easily. And it's the date night edition, guys. We're eating our favorite thing, right, babe? You know, my favorite is like seafood. He loves seafood. He loves I love grilled. crab legs. He loves um shrimp. I love grilled food. Seafood is her favorite, but so tonight, guys, we're eating seafood, which it. I don't mind eating seafood. It really is my favorite, y'all. And since quarantine, I ain't quarantine, been able to have it. Quarantine, 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 quarantine. I usually have it like at least once a month for real. So today I'm trying the Juicy Crab recipe. Since they don't want to share it, I looked at different YouTube channels and I kind of crafted my own together. So I think I may have maybe perfected it. We're going to see tonight. We're going to whip it up. We're going to try it out and we're going to see. Right now, I already got some stuff on the stove. We'll make anything happen. Oh, All right, so I already got the potatoes on the stove. These potatoes have been washed and they're been cut. And also, I have my eggs going on here. And they're almost done. The timer will be going off in one minute. So after this, all we're going to do is we're going to put our sauces together so we'll be back so guys what I'm doing right now is I'm putting my butter I'm melting my butter in the pan one of the recipes that I read it called for four sticks of butter but I think I'm gonna use a little bit more I don't know I'm gonna see how these four sticks look first and then I let y'all know Bay over here making a special juicy sauce. I don't know. Well, this is not necessarily juicy sauce. This is our own little sauce, man. It's the easily sauce. sauce. This is the easily sauce. Matter of fact, this is better than the. This juicy is the sauce. easily. It's the easily sauce. You know Y'all know. Y'all get this at your local store, man. Yeah. Yeah. 
set up. Now, Bay over here cooking, um, chopping up the uh, sausages. You know. Yeah, because have... let me tell y'all why I'm cutting it up on this. Because Bay lost our cutting board. Cap. When we were moving. Cap. And I ain't seen it since. Like, it just disappeared. I don't know what happened to it. Y'all cannot have a real crab boil without sausage. Because you'll just be eating crab legs. That's the only thing you're going to eat. Man, what? I mean, crab. I mean, the sausage and the potatoes, baby. You did in the shrunks. Shrunk, man. But that, look, I'm tell y'all something. Scrunch is the cockroach of the sea. That mean, got Ooh, boo. They got the what is the cockroach of the sea? Scrunch, yeah. Scrunch is the cockroach of the sea. If your parents ain't never told y'all what 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 shrimp contains, it has boo boo. But why you doing that while we um cooking? Man, our viewers need to know what the shrimp contains. When you when you gonna wash your bunny after you? As well, chop it up with garlic. I wanna mix it. I don't wanna chop it up with garlic. Dicers? Yeah. Hi, you ain't got a dicer. They talked about me using the um garlic, the minced garlic in a jar, like it was fresh. So today I went out and bought out some um actual fresh peeled garlic. Yeah, beta type. So what you gotta say about this? I mean, I don't think it's fresh either. I don't think well, nothing. They say it. Man, it ain't fresh. It's sit on the shelf. It's so fresh. People are lying. The people are lying. The FDA is lying. Babe, chopping up the sausages. My 90s, baby. Babe, got the onion powder going. You put onion powder in the seasoning? I mean, um... Yes, I'm, I'm doing my base seasoning. Butter sauce. What that is? Garlic powder next. Still going. Sausages so chop. Chop. Run with that boy, y'all. Chop, chop. This is a lemon pepper. I got the Mrs. Dash lemon pepper. Because I like the extra seasonings that it has in it. Mrs. It's Dash. It's like a um, seasoning blend, but it's salt free. So it's not going to give you too much of a salty taste. Yeah, Mrs. Dash. And yeah. I can actually smell them. Man, can't you smell it? Yeah, I can smell it. Stop playing with it. All right. I'm going to use the Old Bay seasoning. This is where your saltiness is going to come in at. And I I'm know what you got that shit. Add it to the seasoning. Y'all see how much you put in there? No measure. We don't got to measure anything. I'm just free balling it. Black people don't measure nothing. Add more to onion powder. Look at it. More onion powder. Try this at home. You want, uh, you want it spicy? Okay. Yeah, we want it spicy. Alright, so I'm going to try out this Emerald's Cajun seasoning. This is my first time trying this Cajun seasoning. But I think it'll be good. I think it'll replace the Tones Cajun seasoning that you were talking about. Yeah, Tones. Yeah. yeah. Hey, is that the dude from um, Papa John's? What? With? On the on K on the season, that's him. Look at the front, look at the bottom. What? That dude from this Papa. is Emerald, from the uh, the shelf, babe, the famous shelf. Oh, I thought it was Papa John. Hey. I'm only gonna put a little bit of, in, of this Cajun in there because I don't want it to be spicy, spicy. Like I want it to just have like a little small kick to it. So we got that together. Um, I also got this um. Tuscan herb butter, but I don't know if I'm going to use this. Um, we'll see. I didn't use the Tuscan butter, but I ended up needing more onion powder, garlic powder to my mixture, and also the chives. These taste good. Um, I am adding my Xanaran concentrated shrimp and crab boy so I'm just gonna free ball it I'm just gonna add a look I'm just gonna add a little and you don't need a lot of this at all you really don't like I said it is concentrated it's, it's also coming to a boil I have it at a low simmer you ate my rice krispie treat 
Why didn't I put it in the refrigerator? Oh. See? What the? If you don't get out my face. <laughs> Big fat. Our next two ingredients are going to be onion and garlic. And I know you guys who don't eat onions are probably going to be like, ew, but let me tell you, this is going to make your garlic butter sauce taste exactly like the juicy crab sauce. Flex peel, what is a flex peel? Flex peel garlic. They say fresh peel, you know it's flex peel because it's been on the shelf for X amount of days. Guys, guys, it's fresh once it's cut. That's been cut for a minute. Yes. Like mixture inside of the easily sauce. <laughs> this sauce really came out good um i mean you could really see the garlic and the onion in there and even though i didn't know i didn't i don't think they use onions or juicy crab i feel like this is exactly the recipe that juicy crab uses because we don't actually see the onions we think they're garlic so good look at the detail we have one more step here and that's to add the chicken broth and now baby finna get ready to drop the sausage you know my favorite part We added more, we added more um, butter to the easily sauce. Good drink. Nah, I'm just kidding, kids. Don't try that at home. Bartender one on one. I even cut them like a bartender too, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I want to go ahead and remove the sausage and the corn and the potatoes from the boil. I'm adding new water and new Xanarans concentrate and adding in our crab legs and shrimp. For all you wine drinkers. Bringing those to a drinkers. slight boil. We have the wine of the day. It's a barefoot Moscato. Don't know how it tastes yet, guys, because I never tried this brand of Moscato, but I feel like it's going to be delicious. Got this from Publix and it's only $9.99. You know me, I don't be on that wine. You know, I be on that drink, dude. I be on that drink, baby. You know anything about the barefoot Moscato? It, it's a it's a more of a sweet wine, and you know it's a white wine, so it gives you that elegant look. So we already know the white is for the elegant, the red is for the heart. So y'all yeah, know what I mean. So and it's date night, so you know it's a great combination for it. And we got a big bottle of that. 
<laughs> White wine. Oh, it tastes good. Real good. Sweet Moscato. Y'all already know. Have some, guys. It's real sweet. Like, I'm getting like a. Or I'm really getting like a great vibe. Of All right, Easily Gang, thank you for tuning in to today's vlog. This was our non-traditional Easter dinner slash date night. We hope you enjoy. We hope you take this recipe. I promise you, you guys, it tastes exactly like the Juicy Crab recipe. No flicks. I probably will never buy Juicy Crab again. Make sure you guys hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. Easily Gang, we signing out.